Dogecoin looks really close to my second target here at dot 145. I have a limit order waiting here to get filled right now. In my last video, we were watching this channel pattern right here. We were testing the upside or going to the upside but it looks like we got rejected and started pushing down. We broke that bottom support that we were looking at. We had support, 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 giving me that trend line right there. And I was saying if we could break up or if we could break down, then we'll have a better idea whether we're going, we're looking at the targets going to the downside or if we're looking at targets going to the upside. So um, yeah, I thought we were breaking out and I thought we were gonna come up here, but uh, I was also saying that I still have a limit order down here and I was still thinking that it's possible to come down here. We came up just a little bit, like I said, and then we came all the way back down. And I was also saying if we break this Fibonacci retracement level sitting at dot one five zero seven seven, then it's going to be more likely that we're going to come down and hit this level. Um, so right now, yeah, we're looking at dot one four five as a limit order. I just wanted to do a quick update. I was looking at resistance 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 giving me a downtrend like that we actually broke that trend going up but it looks like we got rejected and are pushing back to the downside right now right now the price is at dot one four six three one we are really close to my second target i guess that's the main point of the video is we're really close and um yeah i'm not sure okay so <clears throat> i'm looking at the fibonacci retracement from this small trend right here the bottom of this small run to the top of this run like that and i got the fibonacci retracement level or the fibonacci retracement tool dragged from the bottom to the top that's where i'm getting those levels at if we switch over to the coinbase chart i was also watching if we zoom out let's go to the four hour time frame and we're zooming out right now i was looking i was also watching this fibonacci retracement level from the bottom bottom of the trend to the top 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 of the trend and Basically, same thing. We're watching. We we broke that 50% level right here. Let me go ahead and clear out some of this stuff. We can clear out this one, and we can go ahead and delete these. So those are the Fibonacci retrace. These are the <clears throat> these are the ones on the smaller time frame that I was just telling you about. But we also have this 50% and this 61%. I was also saying that if we break this Fibonacci retracement level, that we can come down and hit this one sitting at dot one three nine approximately. So this is the next target, but I think we still have one more target after that dot one three nine zero. Hopefully at some point we'll get a bounce. And I mean, I'm not super confident on this one. So hopefully we get a bounce right here. This is what I'm really kind of wondering will happen i'm wondering if we're going to get a bounce at this level at dot one four five if we keep going down the next spot that i'll be looking at is dot one three nine <clears throat> excuse me uh if we break that then we'll be looking at the previous all the way at the previous bottom sitting at dot one two zero or this fibonacci retracement down here sitting at dot one one four five this is the 78 percent level on this bigger time frame so yeah, those are the things that I'm looking at. Next target, dot one four five. Let's see if we come down and hit that target real quick and then maybe get a bounce. Or if we come down, I won't be too hurt. If we come down and hit this level, I have another limit order sitting at dot one three nine. But uh, I'm not super confident on this one until we actually break this one going to the downside. But let's see if we can get a bounce on that 50% level. I like watching that 50% level because a lot of times we'll get a run and then we'll go down to 50% and then we'll come pump back to the upside it's also this is another area that it's also possible to happen it really depends on what's happening with the chart if sometimes it'll bounce at the 38 percent level sometimes it'll do the 51 sometimes it'll do the 60 61 uh i think that's the 61 61 50 32 38 yeah hopefully all that makes sense um if you i mean follow along my videos and you might um start to pick it up that's basically how i learned how to do all this stuff yeah, so check out the last video here if you want to follow along and kind of see what I was talking about in the last video. And if you like this video, hit that thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one.